we have seen how to write letter to the principal or class teacher. We have also seen how to write a complaint letter. Uh, if you have brought some product and it is damaged within a few days, then how to write a complaint letter. Right? So we will continue with the formal letter writing. So today also we are going to write letter. Now if your locality is uh, suffering from any problem, there is an issue in your locality, then how to write a letter to the concerned authority. And next we are going to uh, see how to write the letter to the editor. So today we are going to learn two letters. So let's get started. There is a question on the board. Write a letter to SHO, that is Station House Officer, about increasing thefts in your locality. Now, in your locality, in your area, uh, there is an increase in the theft. And you have to write a, a letter regarding this issue. To whom you have to write a letter? SHO, that is Station House Officer. Who are you? Who are you? Shamuja of 62 Pocket 2 uh, Pitapura, New Delhi. So, this is your address. So, your address is given here, your name is given here. Then, to whom you have to write the letter that is given and to what problem you have to mention that is also given in the question. So, first you have to write the senders. So what is the sender's address? Now who are you? Um, you Shavuja. This is your address. 62 pocket 2 Vitamura New Delhi. So that address will come at the left side. 62 pocket 2 Vitamura New Delhi. After address, you need to write the date. So date that is 3 December 2020. After date comes receiver's address and designation and address. Now who you have to write the letter? SHO. So the S H O then is address. Now here you have to write the letter to the message of your locality. So which is your locality? Pitampura. So the SHO police station Pitampura. So this is receivers. After receiver's address comes subject. So what is the subject? Which issue we have to mention in this letter? Increasing thefts. Right? So your subject will be increase in the number of thefts. So that will be the subject. After subject, salutation. Sir. Now you have to write first paragraph. So first paragraph that is introductory paragraph. So you have to give a short description about the issue. So you have to start. We will start that. I want to draw your attention. Towards an alarming increase in thefts in our area or in our locality. So, 
Now subject increasing the number of facts. Same subject you have to describe little more. That will come to your introductory paragraph. After that, you have to write the second paragraph. That is you have to give the detail. Now because of this step, what problems are caused? So that you have to mention in the second paragraph. So there have been about five cases of theft and also chain snatching. in our area in the last two months ok so here we have to mention your problem in detail so for how long that problem is faced by you so what is the problem theft and chain snatching for how many months? Since two months you are facing that problem. So because of that what happens? The residents are afraid to come out of their houses or their life is insecure. Residents are scared. Their life is at risk. So this is the problem. Now in last paragraph you have to write what you want from the receiver, what you expect from the receiver. So what you should suggest, you have to give some suggestions in this concluding. So you would suggest to take some measures and to solve the problem. So what you will write kindly look into the matter and take necessary steps to solve this problem. So this will be your last paragraph. After that, thanking you, yours, faithfully, who are you, Piyush Abuja. So this way you have to write the letter. Okay. Now next letter to the editor. Now you are Asmita Aruna living at 15 civil lines and alone. Write a letter to the editor of a newspaper pointing out the need for immediate improvement in the roads of your society. Now roads of your society are not in a good condition. So you have to write a letter to the editor uh, to be published in the newspaper. And you have to tell the concerned authority, you have to draw the attention of the concerned authority towards this problem and ask them to solve the problem at the earliest. Okay. So first you have to write the senders address that is 15 civil lines Dehradun. so this will be the senders address 15 civil lines
देहरादून आफ्टर दैट डेट थ्री डिसेंबर टू थाउजेंड ट्वेंटी आफ्टर दैट रिसीवर्स एड्रेस नाउ टू हूम यू टू राइट द लेटर द एडिटर सो योर द डेजिटेशन विल बी द एडिटर आफ्टर दैट यू टू राइट द एडिटर्स एड्रेस सो आफ्टर द डेजिटेशन यू नीड टू राइट द नेम ऑफ द newspaper okay the hindustan times new delhi so this is the receiver's address after that subject so what is the subject need for immediate improvement in the roads of your city so you have to write uh, regarding the improvement in the roads that is the roads are not good the roads are miserable so your subject will be miserable condition of roads in our locality so that will be the subject after that salutation is sir now in first passage you have to write your problem what problem you have face in first paragraph you have to mention about your problem so always when you write a letter to the editor you have to begin with uh, through the esteemed columns of your newspaper okay so start to the esteemed columns of your newspaper i would like to draw the attention of concerned authorities words miserable condition of roads in our area so whenever you write a letter to the editor you have to begin through the st columns of your newspaper i would like to draw the attention of concerned authorities towards what was the problem that problem will come here okay now here i would like to draw your attention will not come here because you are not writing directly to the concerned authority you are writing to the editor to be published in the newspaper so you have to write concerned authorities okay now here you have to explain because of this bad condition of roads what problems you face so that will come in the second paragraph okay so you can write there are many what holes which cause accidents so there are many potholes because of potholes accidents are caused so that is the problem then uh, in rainy season 
the condition of rot becomes more worst. So in rainy season, situation becomes all the more worst. Okay, so rainy season more problems are faced due to the miserable condition of roads. Then what happened because of that? The traffic, there is a traffic jam. So normal traffic comes to stand still. So this is your second paragraph. Now describe the problems caused by you due to the bad condition of now in concluding paragraph, you have to tell them to take some steps to resolve your problem. So last paragraph, it is urgent need of R to get the roads repaired. So what you want that the roads should be repaired before any great mishappening occurs. So you have to ask that before some dangerous thing happens, the road should be then you have to tell that the authority should pay the attention, hoping for immediate attention and action in this respect. Next, adding you because see there is no apostrophe in yours. Many of you put apostrophe in your so there is no apostrophe in yours. Yours truly. Who are you? Asmita. So in this way you have to write the letters. I hope you have understood how to write formal letters. Thank you.